Paley Wood is mostly ancient woodland of oak, ash and maple that has been shaped by its long history of use by man for timber and coppice products. This is an ancient wood. It was probably named after the nearby settlement Haley Grange, which was first mentioned in 1164, but was deserted sometime after 1316. For at least a thousand years, the wood has been an island of woodland in the midst of fields. Until very recently, Haley Wood was protected and conserved, managed for the wood and timber, which provided fuel and building materials. England was made out of wild wood. The boundless trees that covered the country from end to end after the last ice age. For 4,000 years down to the Iron Age, farmers were busy grubbing out trees and making new fields. In Roman times there was probably still a great deal of wild wood, but it was no longer untrodden wild wood. A main Roman road runs within two miles of the wood on the east and what may be an even earlier road passes two miles to the west. People were living in the nearby villages in Anglo-Saxon times, rather more than 1,000 years ago, when enlarging their fields into the remaining woods, the early farmers had left certain areas of woodland, and by 1086 the landscape was similar to that that we know today, with many villages and large tracts of farmland surrounded isolated woods. The names Haley, Hutley, Wesley, and others end in Lee, from the Anglo-Saxon Lee, meaning a clearing in the prehistoric wildwood. The ancient woods of the West Cambridgeshire are small remnants of the wildwood, although centuries of management have influenced the appearance of the wood. There have been trees here since the last ice age. They survived because they are on the outcrops of chalky boulder clay, a heavy wet soil unsuitable for ancient agriculture.